It was a rough year for Tavon Austin, but he's back. The veteran wide receiver was set to hit NFL free agency this March, but he'll instead return to the Dallas Cowboys, officially signing a one-year deal worth $1 million with $500,000 guaranteed, according to Todd Archer of ESPN. The cap number on his deal maxes out at $1.328 million due to the inclusion of $750,000 in active game day bonuses and another $250,000 if the Cowboys make the playoffs. The base salary is not far above the veteran minimum for his tenure, listed at $805,000, and the guaranteed money is very team-friendly. Depending upon how things shake out in 2019, particularly with the signing of Randall Cobb to replace Cole Beasley in the NFL draft coming up, wherein the Cowboys will likely select a long-term solution for both that role and as a returner, the jury is out on if Austin survives the final cutdowns. He's a team favorite and very well may stick around, but should the team opt to move on, the dead money hit is only $500,000. Austin was traded in April 2018 to the Cowboys in a deal with the Los Angeles Rams, but got off to a slow start in the season opener against the Carolina Panthers before bursting onto the scene with a 64-yard reception in Week 2 to help do away with the visiting New York Giants. That was the flash the Cowboys were hoping for when they sent a sixth-round pick to Sean McVay in exchange for Austin's services, but his numbers would again fall flat. To make matters worse, he'd suffer a severe groin injury in Week 6 that nearly required surgery, sidelining him for much of the remainder of the season. Unfinished business He'd changed that in a big way when it mattered most though, back from his injury and on the field for the wildcard battle with the Seattle Seahawks. A season wherein the Cowboys have struggled to establish positive field position both with Austin on the field and without him, they got the jolt they needed when he fielded a punt with 11.08 remaining in the game and returned at 51 yards. Tavon Austin is electric. Pick.twitter.com slash 2Echo1Y1B, FanDuel, at FanDuel, January 6, 2019 The drive would end in an interception in the end zone, but Austin had done his part. It's been very hard not being on the field, Austin told Jane Slater of NFL Network. Not just this year, but last year too. I did my wrist surgery, and I hadn't played football in two years, and once again I missed eight games, but it's never going to stop me. As long as my team, my coaches and everybody else believe in me, that's all that matters. In actuality, he did his part twice, returning a kick for a touchdown earlier in the game, before seeing it called back due to a questionable holding penalty. I wish the first one would have stuck to me but flags always find me, since I've been in this league. I just smile at it, and the most important thing is we got the W, there are still things to be ironed out regarding how the Cowboys use and or don't use Austin on offense, a point evidenced by him having just 7 yards receiving on one catch and minus 3 yards rushing on a jet sweep against the Seahawks. They have several months to try their hand once again at figuring that out though, hoping that the second time around is the charm.